Hey everyone, TragicMTG here with today's nonsense, which is Garbage Pill Kids. I uh, know I keep saying that I am not wanting to get into this non-sport nonsense, but I keep finding myself drawn to just a few of the properties that I'm kind of interested in. So we're going to see this from time to time. This is uh, the Chrome series. Um, reprint of the original series 3 which is the one that I started with when I was a kid so I'm really reaching back for some nostalgia here of course Rod Wad right there I uh, look for exclusive black and gold refractor parallels and uh, I think there might be I don't know sketch cards or something like that so um, let's get into this and just have some fun um, I found that there is a subset of my uh, viewers that are into watching me open pretty much anything so hey this counts here we go third series chrome uh, let's see four cars per pack which is kind of odd I'm used to opening at least 15 and these are actually stickers there's a matte quack very shiny so I wonder how the foils will hold up in this series there's a meathead great uh, I'll kind of go a little quickly here Beth death Totem Paula and a Marvin Gardens. Yep, yep, I remember these. This was my third and fourth grade experience in a nutshell. So I'm all about it. Uh, here we go. Farrah Fossil. KO'd Cody. I think Mugged Marcus is the other version. Hothead Harvey. And a broad mod. So actually, I, I believe I do want to actually have a collection. I want to have a binder with a full base set. I'm not going to go after all the parallels or anything, but just to have for funsies, kind of want a full set of these. Pinned Lin, King Size Kevin. So, and I wouldn't know a refractor if it hit me in the head. So, I don't know if that's one or not. It looks kind of normal to me. Slightly a little more rainbow. I might have to look that one up here. Hurt Kurt and Half Nelson. Um, so yeah, that one just seems to be a little bit more rainbowy. So I think that might be a refractor. Let me see. Do the does it say on the back? It is. Yeah, a refractor. Okay. I'm new to this hobby. It's not my usual thing. Rod Wad in yellow. Does that make him? Anything different? No, I don't think so. That's regular. Curly Carla. Ro Rob O. Cops. This is a AN7. It's not one of the originals. Flake Flake is, though. So that is a alternate art, something like that. All new, I think is what it's called. Let's go here. Not sure what the chances are of getting like something really good and not even sure what the chances are of being able to turn around and sell something like that I'm just doing this for fun Baron Aaron that's great Rocky and Roll Alice Island and the Smelly Sally and checklists on the back but none of those are refractors I don't believe Dwight Bite I remember Apple Cory being the alternate of that. Bullseye Berry. Bruised Lee. Very shiny. Literal mirror. You can see the stuff on my ceiling right there. And an alligator. Awesome. So some of these are new, I believe. Zombie fad, yeah, like a zombie. It's poking fun at like walking dead and stuff. So the backs have some new kind of stuff. I will look at that later. At my leisure. Green Dean. The yellow throws me off. I think that's just the background of the original card. It's a fellow co-worker. Picky Mickey. Spitting Spencer. That's a new one. And a Joe Blow. So at least I've got two of the starters for this set. Put them into a binder and enjoy them. All I want after that. Jelly Kelly. U.S. Arnie, I guess, is a refractor. Does it say it there somewhere? Refractor, yep, right there at the top. You can, so you can just tell the difference. There's a little more rainbow to the to the shine there. 
Warman Norman, and Snooty Sam. So that's the regular edition. There's definitely a difference on the refractors there. We'll put it there. Pat Splat. Another refractor. Starin Darren. Uh, it says refractor down there. Yep, sure enough. Wrigley Renee and a Starin Darren again. Yep, so we got the regular version of that as well. Cool. Still Jill. <laughs> Gross. Revved Upton. So I've talked about this before how when I collected Garfield Kids in the 80s as a kid, buy them from the ice cream man. After a while, my parents frowned upon them. They actually started looking at them, I think, so they took them all away. So here's my revenge. I can now buy them whenever I want. DDT, Undead Jed, Motor Ned, Cashed in Casey. So that's a new art. Gotcha. Purchased Percy. So there's the other version of Cash and Casey. This purple refractor. So this is the alternate half Nelson. So I think this might actually be numbered on the back. Yeah. 85 out of 250. Pretty cool. Alright, so that that's what... If you were super into this, I'm only mostly into this, you would try to uh, get a complete set of the alternates. That would be quite expensive to do. Apple Cory and Target Margaret. Peepin' Tom, Polish Paul. So this is the alternate art or new art of Rod Wad. Looking pretty good there. Charlotte Webb and Frankenstein. I like the card quality. Very thick. And the foiling is extremely nice. Probably won't curl up like a magic card. Dash aboard. Oh, that's a new one as well. Eager Beaver. Gooey Gabe. Yuri Eric. That's an original. I don't know if I've ever seen it though. And a Mushi Marsha. Yep. 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 I don't know if I don't know if like kids today would even be into Garbage Pail Kids because what they're spoofing not even around anymore. Really, Cash Patch Kids. So there's a Sticky Rick, and that is a Refractor Chromed Chris. Not a numbered one. Ophelia Ornament and T2 Tootie Terminator Girl Las Vegas Whoops Croaking Colin Adam Byrne, that's a new one and a babbling brook Nice little stack here to work with and put my set together. Chromie Joni. Oh, there we go. So this is different. Juicy Jessica. That's not just a refractor. What is that? That's 64 out of 199. Um, what do they call this? So not a refractor parallel or some kind of hollow parallel. So it's even thicker, I think than the other ones. So, that's cool. Punchy Perry. I'm still learning about this particular hobby. And again, I keep saying Stone Shot. I don't know if I really want to fully get into this, but here we are. Getting into it. Glandular Angela. Karate Kate. Chromed Chris again, I think. And a gluey Gabe. So opening a box like this, I might not come up with a full base set, but I'd probably be halfway or pretty close to it. Galloping Glen. Well done, Sheldon. Dinosaur. 
And a mugged Marcus. I've got both of those at least now. Marshy Marshall again. Hey, wow, that's pretty cool. Well done, Sheldon. Purple refractor. Another 250. 61 out of 250. And a Rocky and Roll and a Toady Terry. Brad Habit. <laughs> Golem Gary, that's new art, all new. Drew Blood. Horsey Henry. A lot of checklists on the back when I flip them over, looks like. All right, are we going to get any kind of sketch or anything more premium than that? Joe Nut, Hippie Skippy, Silent Sandy, Ned Head. Bustin' Dustin and a green parallel, Mormon Norman. Out of 299, 174 out of 299. Foul Raul and Grim Jim. All right, one pack left. Zippy Zeke and a black refractor parallel, I guess. Louis Gabe. So this one is a lower number, 19 out of 99. So that's pretty decent. And a humongous. And a precious peat. There we go. So there's my stack of GPK out of my box. Had fun doing it. Hope everyone enjoyed it. I will get to work putting this in a binder and making a little collection. That's it. Thanks for watching. Catch you later.